Hello everyone, welcome to Manmaker. I am Ranjan Kumar and today we are going to discuss about recently BL have released notification uh, for a permanent basis in Bangalore unit that we are going to discuss. I already uploaded today that short notification of that one. So now we are going to discuss in a details of that non-executive uh, vacancy. So here you can see they have released for Bangalore complex on a permanent basis this job okay and uh, two post is there EAT that is engineering assistant uh, trainee and technician C okay for engineering assistant trainee three year diploma required in engineer in the field of electronics mechanical computer science and electrical okay so this uh, <coughs> for electronics total 40 post is there for mechanical 29 post is there for computer science 5 post is there for electrical 6 post is there so total 80 vacancy they have released for EAT for technician C for technician C ITI certificate required ITI degree required in the field of electronic mechanics filter mechanics or electrician okay so for uh, electronic mechanic 46 post is there for filter uh, 26 post is there for mechanist four post is there for electrician six post is there okay so total 82 they have released for technician so total they have released 162 post for uh, in a non-executive post okay now here age is there like that uh, minimum age it should be 18 year and maximum age it should be 28 year okay for general and ews category okay and uh, your relaxation will be like that uh, for OBC it will be 3 year means 28 plus 3 you can apply SCST it will be 5 so 28 plus 5 and PWBD <coughs> PWBD it will be 10 year so uh, 28 plus 10 it will be all right now if you see uh, qualification in detail so as you have done diploma so in the diploma your uh, percentage should be 60 percent and above and uh, uh, for uh, general and obc and ews and 50 percent and above for uh, scst and pwbd same for uh, iti also okay here it is mentioned like that and the thing is experience not required here it is pure fresher job so uh, the mandatory thing is you should have registration in karnataka employment exchange if you have registration number in karnataka employment exchange then only you are uh, you are eligible to apply this thing okay and it should be active till 4 november 2025 if it will it expired so you have to apply again and uh, again you have to fill that registration number okay if you don't have this thing if you are belong to karnataka just go to employment exchange uh, office and do registration after that only you are eligible for uh, apply this form okay now method of selection method of selection will be cbt that is your computer based exam will be there computer based test will be there and it will be held only in bangalore in bangalore only you will get the exam center and uh, uh, the thing is uh, after that dv is there document verification after you get qualify in this written test okay so total 150 marks will be there for written test uh, it will be divided into two part general aptitude that will be your 50 marks and technical aptitude it will be your 100 marks i already discussed details syllabus and uh, exam pattern material previous year question i already discussed you just go this video i already uploaded today only you just go and check this one and uh, i will share that material whatever material is there you can uh, you have to take that one and pre start preparation for this exam here the thing is you have to for qualification uh, sorry for qualify this exam you should have 35 percent in part one also and 35 percent in part two also for general obc and ews and 30 percent for scst and pwd in both part like part one and part two you need to score good marks in both the part if any like if you are not uh, qualify in part one 
then you are not going to get a job okay so you should have a uh, knowledge of both the thing either it is non technical or technical okay likewise my material is there you need to follow that one okay and here they have mentioned like tentative month of the this exam will be november december so most probably it your exam is going to happen in the december month only okay so you have enough time just prepare like that and application fee they have uh, given 500 plus 18 percent gst so total 590 rupees you have to pay for general obc and dws this is application fee for SCST and PWBD ex servicemen, there is no any application fee is there for them. Okay. And uh, for apply, a link is there directly. You can go to BL site. Here you will get click here to apply the post. Just click there, you will get application form and start filling that form. Okay. And uh, last date they have given for this exam uh, this form is your fourth november till 4 november you uh, you can apply for this post okay after that after applying that one just check this video and uh, drop a message on this number i will provide you this uh, study guide of bl exam and uh, start preparation for your exam okay here you will get uh, a subject wise short notes whatever subject is there in your topic in your syllabus like that uh, subject wise short notes is there then subject wise mcq is there that you need to practice 500 important and expected question is there with detailed explanation that you need to cover then three set of model test paper same to same like your exam uh, like that it is set so you need to practice that uh, and there also important question is there you need to cover that one also and previous year question you will get which was happened last year in bangalore or this year only january or february month uh, they already taken exam so that paper i will provide you and some classes already i have taken i will provide you that thing also okay so just drop a message here and get this one start your preparation only one month is there one one uh, one month or 1.5 month is there in your hand for preparation okay so that's all for today Thank you. Just apply this thing. Alright. Thank you.